Hi, welcome back to my channel. Um, today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I filled a stocking for under £10 at Aldi. Um, we usually do a Christmas Eve box every year, but we decided this year we were just going to do Christmas Eve stockings um, because otherwise we end up spending loads of money um, and our budget was £10 each. Um, so I'll show you what I got for Anthony. He's done the same for me, um, but I'll show you what I've got. And I think, to be honest, I did quite well. And there were a couple of things that was a bit more expensive where you could have swapped them out for something cheaper. Um, but I just wanted the items that I got, so I'll show you. First of all, oh no, it's broken. It wasn't broken when I bought it, but chocolate Santa. I'll just flat his, flatten his face down a bit. So this is chocolate Santa and it, it, it's massive. This was, I think, £1.25 um, from Aldi. So I think that's really good. Everyone loves a chocolate Santa. They also had um, chocolate unicorns. They had a white one and a brown one. Um, this is just milk chocolate. So this is chocolate Santa. Um, it's a bit sad that he's broke, but it's because it was hung up on the fireplace and I think because it's heavy, it's dropped off. Um, but that's Chocolate Santa. I love a Chocolate Santa and I also think Aldi chocolate is, is the best chocolate ever. Next, I got some caramelised biscuit flavour cookies. These cookies are really thick. Um, they're quite heavy and it's a copy of the Lotus Biscoff spread. Um, so Anthony will love those. I think these were like £1.25. Um, so they're really good. Then we've got milk chocolate peanut butter Christmas trees. These was £1.50, which they do have other bags of chocolate for like a pound. Um, but Anthony likes these. My dad bought us some last year. Um, and Anthony really liked them, so I got them, uh, got these for him. And um, they do get quite a lot in the bag, to be honest. Um, but the, they are a bit moreish, so you just keep eating them. But yeah, put in those. Next, I got him the salted pretzel chocolate. So it's smooth and creamy milk chocolate with crunchy salted pretzel pieces. Now, this is about two pounds. It is quite pricey for Aldi, but it is so thick. Like that whole, that whole like box is full of chocolate. It's so thick um, and it's really, really nice chocolate. Like you would struggle to eat that full bar. Um, it's bigger than, it's probably like the same size as a sheer size bar of chocolate. It's 200 grams um, and it says, delicious milk chocolate with salted pretzel pieces creates a real chocolate treat. As a chocolate lover, it'll be hard to resist trying all the other indulgent products in our range lovely but yeah it's it's really nice the bits of pretzel in it are quite big as well um but he loves this it used to be in a blue box but now it's red um but this is his, one of his favorite chocolates from aldi what else have we got chocolate coins these was on offer for 75p um so i got two packets of these um the, the from the dairy fine range which is the same as this um, I don't know if this is dairy fine. Doesn't say. Um, but the dairy fine chocolate from Aldi is actually really good. Um, we prefer the Aldi chocolate coins rather than like Tesco or Morrison's. The chocolate's just really nice. Um, they all they had milk chocolate and white chocolate, um, but I got him two milk chocolate bags of coins. What else have we got? Two more things. So, strawberry flavoured sour snowmen. Um, I don't think he's. I, I don't think he's ever tried these. Um, it just says strawberry flavoured gummy sweets with a sour sugar coating. Um, it's quite a big bag. Um, 160 grams. Um, yeah, 99 PVs were. They also had strawberry Santas, I think it was, and they wasn't sour. Um, they do feel quite soft. Do you know sometimes you get fizzy sweets or jelly sweets and they're really hard, like fruit pastels. They do feel quite soft, so that's good. Um, so yeah, 
gotten these um and to be honest i want to try the strawberry santas so anthony if you're watching this that's just a little idea um, but yeah i'm sure they like those and then one more thing that i got i think it's one more here it is giant buttons um, these are milk chocolate and white chocolate um 120 grams again from the dairy fine range um we love these chocolate buttons they also have milk chocolate white chocolate and then they've got some um caramel filled ones and these and i'm sure at one point they had chocolate orange ones um but i, I didn't see those otherwise i would have gotten but yeah these are the you know what they're called blended um chocolate buttons so yeah this is what i've put in his stocking I mean, to be honest, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, and then two of the coins, seven, eight. Eight things, and it came to £9.70. Um, I think that's really good. So I think Aldi's definitely a good place to look um, for doing a stocking. It's, it's, I know it's not branded. But I mean, you can get branded stuff there, but you can also do this stocking a lot cheaper. Like, there was £1.50. For a child, you might not want to buy them peanut butter, like peanut butter cups. They've got loads of little bags of sweets for like 45p. Um, obviously, we do smaller bags of the buttons for 50p. Um, so I just think you could fill up a stocking for a... You could probably fill up a stocking for like £6. Uh, but we just did a £10 challenge, so yeah. Um, Santa is definitely your go-to. £1.25, it's huge. And like, if you compare it to the size of the stocking, that's quite a big stocking as well. Um, if you compare it to the size of the stocking, you know, it does take up some room. Um, but yeah, I'm going to have to maybe put a bit of tape on it. Um, he's already opened the stocking anyway, so he knows what's inside it. And luckily, he opened it before Santa got smashed. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you did, pop me a comment and a like down below. Um, don't forget to subscribe if you are enjoying the content and I will be back soon with another video. Bye!